Hey there, community kids. Welcome back to another week of our kids mini series. We're so glad you're here. Um, I brought my friend, Miss Kelly, with us from the East Jordan campus again. And tonight we have Dave coming to show us some experiments and help us learn to grow in Jesus and why that's so important through some memory verses that we're going to put in our hearts and hope to keep there forever. So why don't you join us in a time of worship?
Everybody, I'm Mr. Dave, coming to you from home today with the uh, coronavirus stuff going on. We're gonna tape this episode of uh, Awana at home. I was hoping to teach you guys at, uh, at Awana on stage, but it's not gonna happen. So um, I really miss getting to see you guys. It's uh, been a long time away from Awana, and uh, it's pretty tough on all of us. And I imagine it's really tough on you guys. So now I'd like to open us up in prayer and uh, get started. Dear Heavenly Father Jesus, thank you for the opportunity to reach out to these boys and girls in this time and um, let them watch this video and gain from it, Lord. Please um, be with them and keep them safe and um, help it to lead people to you. In Jesus' name, amen. All right. So I got a couple verses for you today. And then we're going to do some experiments. But uh, I would, I, I would want to challenge you guys to uh, get out your Bibles and get out your Wana books. And to uh, be studying some verses and reading some verses with all this free time we have. Being at home all the time, I know we got a lot of opportunity to uh, get distracted by other things. But uh, getting a verse in and, and, and sticking it in your heart is going to be with you forever. And a lot of these other things are very fleeting. Um, 
So I want to challenge you guys to get out your books and to uh, and study your verses. I got a verse here I'd like to read to you, and it's it's it. Gee, this is from Jesus. It's in Luke chapter six, verse forty-three, and um, through forty-five. And it, it, it really is going to show you a lot about the, the things that we're going to do here in a couple minutes and the fun that I'm going to have with my uh, helper. No good tree bears bad fruit, nor does a bad tree bear good fruit. Each tree is recognized by its own fruit. People do not pick figs from thorn bushes or grapes from briars. A good man brings good things out of the good stored up in his heart. And an evil man brings evil things out of the evil stored up in his heart. For the mouth speaks what the heart is full of. And uh, today we're going to do some experiments. And I, I've got a helper. He's going to help me. And um, I was planning on having people come up on stage and that knew a verse. And then they could help with the experiments. But instead today, I hope you guys do your verses at home. And my helper will read a verse. And he'll, he'll help me with the experiments and to uh, make them go. If they go, we're hoping to uh, have fun, have a real good time, and uh, give you some real fruitful entertainment as well as a reason to uh, store some verses in your heart so that they can flow out. Hi, everybody. We're here in our backyard. It's me and Jonah, my assistant today. We're going to be doing some experiments for you to show how God's Verses grow in your heart, flow out of you. We're going to start with an experiment you can do at home. This one's baking soda. We're just going to put some baking soda in here. Okay. With these experiments, we're trying to get a chemical reaction. So they explode. Not so much explode as grow. Just to show you how putting Bible verses in here. So, uh, assistant, can you read this for us and add some? Acts 16.31 Believe in the Lord Jesus and you will be saved. Pretty hard now, so now it's gonna the bubbles are floating yeah. out all over the place. Great is our Lord and mighty in power. Alright, stand to the side. To the side. Now look at the camera. And okay, look. Here we go. Let's see what it does. This one I think will probably go pretty quiet. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, 
Uh -oh. It might be the slow motion one if it works. We'll see. Oh, it looks like it's slow motion, but it's doing it. So. As we put these verses into our hearts, Which they spill out to others and in our actions, and that's what we're trying to demonstrate here. All right, assistant, you ready? Yep. I'm gonna give you. I'm gonna give you this one, and we're gonna go around front. You can stand by the one that's really starting to bubble. Good now. Oh, well, right. that was gonna shoot a bit. And I'm gonna read mine first, okay? Mine is Acts 16:31. Believe in the Lord Jesus and you will be saved. What? Rich John 419. You will love because he first loved us. Ready? Go. Sure we can see. Woo! There it goes! Wow, that green is that going on. Whoa! 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 Of the Lord stands forever. Here it goes. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, come on, come on. Shoot up in the Look, it's going to look happy like a mushroom. You think so? A mushroom. Red mushroom. And the final finale! Alright, well thank you guys for joining us today here in the backyard. Doing some science experiments and uh... Showing you how the Lord's verses will grow in your hearts. Hope to see you soon. Have a nice week. Thanks so much for joining us tonight in our time of worship. We hope you're going to have a great week. Bye. Bye.